Thank you, Troy. Chef Bernard Tamburella once again from Moss Rock Tacos and Tequila. Also, Vecchia there in the preserve in Hoover. And we're making queso, showing you how to make queso. And we started this process. Now, was that heavy cream? What'd you put in there? That, that is milk. Just milk, okay. Yeah, you can use heavy cream, but I like to use milk. Mm -hmm. And I like these thatched chilies, these little green. Oh, yeah. Put them in there, put it, and warm it up. And you want to like, I like to, I've got, everybody uses a crock pot. Mm -hmm. Well, let's go back in time when we didn't have, when we were young, we didn't have crock pots. We had double boilers. Yeah. So we take the water, we take a pot and put it inside of it. We heat it up and make it happen. Okay. So we got, I got some milk in here. So there's milk in there too. When we're getting it warm, we don't, the reason you use a double boiler is because you don't want to scorch. Yeah. Because scorch, when you scorch milk or cheese, no. it takes it way too far out. So we got our milk in here. We got our thatch chilies in here. We're going to put some chipotle in here. Mm-hmm. We're going to, this is my favorite spice. What Ooh, is I that? love that. Cumin. Like, yeah, cumin. So cumin gives cumin. you a smoke, but a... It's, it's not overbearing, though. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. We're going to throw some garlic in here. And then I've got some salt and pepper we're going to put in here. This is a very Bingo. flavorful queso. It is. You want... You Some want, are kind of bland. This is not. No, we're not going to bland. I cannot stand bland stuff. Mm -hmm. So we'll mix this together. As you can see, it's steaming, so we're starting to heat. And the reason I did it, didn't put it in here, okay. I put it in here. I want to activate the spices, get them hot, hot, hot real quick, like so everything fuses together. So here we got some, for everybody at home, Velveeta. Let's just call it white Velveeta. We call it different at the restaurant, but it's basically the same thing. We're going to put that in there. Could you use different types of cheeses? You can, but it's the, the Velveeta has got more of a creamier texture. Mm -hmm. You use a mozzarella, it's more stringy. You use a provolone, it just doesn't work. And this right here is designed for. Now, so we've got that in there. The milk was already hot. The queso is room temperature. We're going in there, let it sit. We've got a little bubble here. We'll pour this in there. And I don't know if you can see on the overhead camera, the water was boiling. But the milk was not. No, the milk yeah. was not boiled. It, it'll get to the right temperature. It goes to, and I'm going to throw this out there. Boiling point's 215, so it probably goes to about one, 180. Okay. You All know, right. something like that where it doesn't scorch. And we're going to let that melt. And we got about a minute, so you know the process. No, here. we're, we're not going to go real melt. fast. But, and you want to keep it stirring, and you can see it activates really, really quick like. Mm -hmm. And so the recipe will tell you the, the, portions that you want to put in milk to cheese you don't have to sit here and stir it like i do but i just like to look good on tv and you know you, <laughs> you look good on tv whether hey, you're I try to. i do want to say hello to the young lady last night when i had to go through public she yeah. recognized me and she said hey 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 i said thank you young lady in uh uh caldwell mill Publix. you nice, can't go anywhere nice to see you, I, you can't do you have your cooking show on tv how'd she know you she knew me from here Oh, she well, recognized well, thank, me well, thank you for watching. Uh, apparently, I got this voice that everybody knows. Mm -hmm. She recognized the voice. She looked at my face and says, I know you. <laughs> All right, All right, everybody see this? Oh, yeah, yeah, we, see it. we see it. Bada bing, bada boom. Now, for TV purposes, we only got about 30 seconds. It may not be fully melted. If we don't get there, it'll be that way when we finish up. Guess what? Mickey will be in here in a second. He'll That's right. He'll tell us if it's melted or not. We're going to continue stirring. We're going to get it ready, piping hot and ready for you to see what it looks like, the finished product. You stick around. We'll be right back. Ciao, guys. Thank y'all. Hey folks.